All right, so I have a Jensen 20G hooked up to a torn apart hand crank flashlight. And essentially what I'm going to do is see if it can actually charge the phone. Right now I'm at 45% battery and we'll see what happens. All right, I got the phone charger plugged in. I'm just waiting for uh, pressure to build a little bit more. Actually, I think we should be good just to let it go now. Just gotta get the water out the cylinders. Okay, so now we're at 44%. Uh, let's see how long it takes. Um, I'm going to let this run non-stop for about 10 minutes. And um, yeah, we're just going to see how things go. So a couple minutes in, I'm at 42%. Um, I think what's happening is it's the uh, circuit board here is not putting out a steady amount of voltage or breaking even on electricity to you know maintain my phone's charging capability if that makes any sense so basically there's more energy going out than there is going into the phone um i think that has a lot to do with the pulsations of the steam engine like it's a reciprocating piston piston steam engine whereas um the electricity we get from like the power grid is powered by steam turbines um but other than that i really don't know what's causing my phone to lose a little bit of electricity every time or a little bit of charge every time rather but um i'll keep you guys updated okay so we seem to be fluctuating between 41 and 40 percent battery so i don't know if i would call this a phone charger as well as a charge maintainer but um yeah, it's actually maintaining a charge. Now I'm gonna try to keep this video as short as possible because of the fact that I don't wanna to use too much battery and ruin the test, but it seems to be doing the job pretty well uh, of maintaining the charge of 40%, so there you go. All right, we're at 38% battery. Um, it's a bit of a drop, but it, like I said, this thing is maintaining a charge rather than, um, how do I put it? You know, putting enough electricity in where I can use my phone and, you know, keep an eye on the steam engine because there's a sight glass in the front of the steam engine where you need to keep an eye on the water. But uh, I'm gonna power this thing down just by turning the switch right here. Maybe. But yeah, um, when it's all said and done, I'm just gonna review the, uh, the battery once more and we'll see what happens. Okay, so after everything was said and done with the Jensen 20G phone charger that I have rigged up, um, I'm at 38% battery at the end of the test. Now, remember, I did rip apart a hand crank flashlight to do the test, and all I really wanted was the board and the electrical generator. So, 
uh, maybe I can make some improvements or get a breadboard and make my own circuit. That's what I plan on doing, actually. But because of my crazy work schedule, that probably won't be for a while. But again, please like, favorite, share, and subscribe for more content coming to you very soon. Take care, everybody.